Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah. Today I created a no makeup makeup look. Um, if you guys want to see how I made this look, then uh, keep on watching. <laughs> to start off this look, I'm going to focus on my skincare. Now I'm starting with a clean face um, as if I were to have just gotten out of bed. To moisturize my skin, I'm going to use the Tatcha Water Cream. What I love to do though, is to mix with my moisturizer a little bit of this. And this is the Kiehl's Daily Reviving Concentrate. I feel like it kind of wakes my skin up. Next up for skincare, I'm gonna throw on some eye cream. And for that, I'm gonna use the Ola Henriksen Banana Bright Eye Cream. For today, I'm going to use a primer, even though I'm not gonna put a lot of makeup on. Um, and for that, I'm gonna use Ola Henriksen Banana Bright Face Primer. Brows are the most important part of this routine for me. So it's the one item that I'm going to take the most time on. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna take a sheer press powder and lately I've been using the ColourPop uh, no filter sheer press powder in the shade dark. You can use whatever pressed powder that you would like to do. I just prefer to use, or translucent, like you can use a translucent powder. I just prefer to use one that's more of my skin tone. So I'm just patting this onto my brows. And the thing is, with all of those different skincare items that I put on, I wanna make sure that my brows actually have something to stick onto. I don't want them slipping and sliding throughout the day because hey, that's about the only thing that can happen on my face. I don't wanna take the time to do my eyebrows if they're not gonna stick. So I'm gonna use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in the shade Granite. So that for me is one brow, and that is two brows. Next step for me is to set my brows in place. For that, I'm gonna use the Benefit Gimme Brow in the shade number five. So for an everyday basis, like this is basically how I'll run out the door. This is it. I won't do anything else, but I want a little look, <laughs> a little more put together. I'll throw on a little bit of concealer. I'm gonna take the Clinique Beyond Perfecting Foundation Plus Concealer. I'm gonna use this as a concealer. This is in my foundation shade, which is 23 Ginger, but I'm gonna use it as a concealer, so. Next thing I'm gonna do is take that uh, that sheer pressed powder I was using earlier from uh, ColourPop and then just press that onto my cheeks. So now that my face is done, I do like to set my face. This is the Kapari Coconut Rose Toner. I will say the spray on this guy is a little uh, aggressive <laughs> to say the least. So make sure you have distance between your face and this before you spray it on. And every time I use this to set my no makeup makeup looks, I get asked if I'm wearing any makeup. You know, people are like, you're wearing makeup? Really? Next up, I'm gonna curl my lashes and apply some mascara just so that my eyeballs don't disappear into my face. For 
for today, I'm gonna layer the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara in Carbon Black and the Maybelline Big Shot Mascara in Black. off the look, I'm just gonna take my favorite lip balm, which at the moment is the Skin Fix Barrier Plus Lip Repair Balm. Now a little trick that I like to do is take a brown lip liner, um, I would suggest any of the BFF lip liners from ColourPop, and just line your lips. I'm just gonna take my favorite lip gloss. Today I'm gonna use the ColourPop So Juicy lip gloss and this is in the shade Cutie. That completes this video. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next upload. Bye. <laughs> kind of the purpose of this serum, it does say. Oh my God. I made a little mosh dance. What? That didn't even make sense. Did you hear what I just said? <laughs> Setter? Spray? <laughs> I'm bad for no lashes, right? <laughs>